All right, into the last part of per unit tax, which unfortunately is also going to be the most difficult and the longest part of this on this series of video, right? The last part we are going to talk now. Remember, last video we talked about something we call tax burden, right? How the burden, part of the burden would be on consumer and part of the burden would be on producer, right? Now here. This last part, we're going to talk about what is the factor affecting who would be having more burden and who would be having lower burden, right? In fact, the answer lies here, okay? The key, whoever more elastic would bear less burden. You know, you elastic would say that you see get. Okay, now you can think of this as a game of dodgeball, right? What is most easy to play? Actually, you play this. This is like a chess game. Think of it as a dodgeball, right? Now, dodgeball, the faster player, usually, the other player is faster, right? He will be more likely to hit, right? You are less likely to hit. You are not that fast to hit him. The other player. 好鬼快嘅，身手好好嘅。Versus if the enemy are slower, you find yourself easier, OK, to hit， 係嘛？你容易啲掟中佢嘅 ，OK。The same here. Think of it this one as the government. 掟個波出嚟嘅咪 government 咯。There are two players. One of the player is called producer. Another player is called consumer. Whoever move faster, he or she, depending on who you think、uh, they are, right, would be less likely to be hit. We say slow down, right? Therefore, the more elastic, the faster player would dodge more of the tax. Okay. Now, what does that mean? To put it into perspective, okay. In the case if ED is larger than ES, okay, which means producer more elastic, it means that consumer would bear less burden, and that means producer bear、uh, more burden, right? Okay, done that. So this is the key. Now, boys, before we move on, let me let us do a simple revision. This is back in the days when we talk about demand and supply. Now, if you remember, I asked you, right? Unless in extreme cases, okay, demand curve always draw like this, a normal slope, right? Am I right? This is elastic part. This is in elastic part. Why I insist you draw like this instead of in your textbook? You see, in your textbook they say elastic like this, in elastic like this. Exactly because of this chapter, okay? 你呢种话法咧 ，so far it works in DSE, but by the end of this video, we are going to look at one type of mutation question. 有一种系未出过，但系可以出嘅题目。If you use this kind of drawing, good luck. I mean it. Good luck. 你好自为之啦，唔送啦。Okay. Now we will see. You will see what I mean by the end of this video. Now let's do the normal ones. Okay. For the case of now, so you will be thinking, Mr. Sir, 如果我 demand 唔变 how do I manipulate? How do I manipulate、uh, the elasticity? 醒少少 ，we are using a comparison of ED and ES. 其實你喐一個咪得咯。The only one you need to change is actually ES. 你淨係喐 ES 咪得咯。你 ED 唔使搞噶。Okay, now so let's try. Here, we want a graph where. Consumer tax burden is larger than producer tax burden. Now, using our motto, whoever more elastic will eat less. 而家邊個食少啲啊？而家 producer 食少啲啊嘛
we know that ED should be smaller than the ES. Right? Supply being more elastic, therefore it eat less, right? Okay, how do you say it? Don't do it, don't do it. Don't draw first. Watch me. Then we play the video, draw with me. This is not an extreme case. Therefore, okay, do me a favor. Demand, draw it normally. Yes, I mean it. Draw it normally. Okay, now we want ES to be bigger than ED. The only thing we need to do is to make supply more elastic. Or turn to S, what elastic did? Do you remember how to draw an elastic supply? Okay, if you remember, it is actually uh, more horizontal this is s1 okay now remember tax is an upward shift okay now shift body okay let's shift it this may this much okay use it on our journey to the supply curve shift now label p1 Q1, but do highlight. The important one to label is this guy. P2 and go Q2. This is very important. Highlight for yourself. Tell yourself, the people is Q2. Now, you will see. This increase. This is the increase in price, right? If you remember, Increase in market price. Who suffer? This green box. The one to suffer will be the consumer, consumer tax burden. But look at this supply curve, right? The vertical distance is the per unit tax. Let us know. Here, we still have a little bit of tax here. Then the rest of this red box. Okay, the rest of this red box, the remaining will be our producer tax burden. Okay, then finally, remember, we know quantity would drop. Later on in, in subsidy, you will see this is problematic. Very easy to misdraw something. Okay, done that. So this is how you draw. Check that CC, CB, PB. Clearly, right? You got home and he not. Okay, done that. So let's try the next one. Now, I suggest if you want to take the challenge, try it by yourself first before you continue watching the video. Okay, now, which means this time, since CB consumer it's less, it should be more elastic. But remember what I said don't do anything funny. Don't do anything funny with demand. Just go like this. This is our demand. Now this time we want supply or to use supply high inelastic here. Okay, so what do we do? Let's draw a supply here. Okay, a more vertical supply here. S1. Like it you all, it's an upward shift. Okay, therefore, let's shift it this much. But as you put it together, you will see it actually is a very big shift. Okay? Let's mark it down. P1, P2. Okay, this is increase. Alright, Q2 right here. Mark it down. 我們是要Q2。好了,跟著我們抹埋Q1啊。提醒自己我們Q2做的,好嗎? This is an increase in market price. Who would suffer when market price increases? Now I think you know the answer, right? This would be our consumer tax burden. Well, but now some of you think, my water, so same fat tax, come the 
Voila, tagged him. Okay, the rest of the text, this part. Okay, this remaining. 剩低啲嚿啊，係嘛 ？This part will be our producer tax burden. 好，睇下先。Consumer tax burden smaller than producer tax burden. Correct. Okay, then that. So remember, boys. The only thing you need to change is actually only the slope of the supply curve. 唔使做好多嘢嘅咋。Okay, now, boys. Before you move on, I suggest pause the video. Try to draw these two graphs by yourself first. 睇落好似好容易，實情好容易畫錯噶。Okay, practice it. Follow the step to practice this first before you move on. Okay. 好嘛，嗱 ，I suggest let's do it the other way round. You will see on the next page. I have prepared four extreme cases for you, but let's practice the normal cases first. 我哋練習咗正常個 case 先，跟住先翻轉頭睇啲誒 special case 啊，好嘛 ？OK, now two thousand and no 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 nineteen. 95， 唔係 2000， 一九九五年嚟㗎，係嘛？嗱 ，suppose the government impose a per unit tax of five dollars， OK？ Under what condition would the price increase by five dollar？ OK？ 嗱 ，let's skip this。This is an extreme case。呢個係一個 extreme case 嚟㗎。幾時會升五蚊啊？嗱 ，basically think about this。A tax of five dollars， and at the same time。Consumer, ah, I pull the gold here. Price increased by five dollars. What does that mean? All of this will be consumer tax burden. 全部都系 consumer 食晒 ，OK? All of this will be consumer tax burden. By our token, whoever more elastic will eat less. 系咪？而家有个人系快到完全唔使食，咁咪 extreme case 咯。We know producer is not eating anything, so producer must be infinitely fast, 无限咁快 What does that mean? It means that supply E S most likely equals to infinity, or another case, maybe 系佢无限咁快咧，可能倒转咧。Consumer being infinitely slow, static, right? So let's see the answer here perfectly in the last thing. Now don't worry, we will go back to this part. We will go back to this part after we are done with the normal. Okay? 好啦，哇， this is my favorite question. 好多人就係揸住呢條教錯曬啦。Okay, boys, study this question with a grain of salt. 唔該你自己小心啲温書。Okay? 好啦，先睇。Per unit tax. No seller would bear relatively smaller portion than a a a seller, 係咪 ？Than buyer. 咩意思啊 ？It means PB producer tax burden is smaller than the consumer tax burden. When would this happen? We know that when ED demand is, ah、uh, ah、uh, uh, sorry. When supply is More elastic than demand. 重點係 more elastic. Okay, what does that mean? This. Let's talk about this. 有咩情況之下可以 more elastic 啊 ？Case number one. Let's say this is zero point eight, zero point three. 零點八係咪大過零點三啊 ？Yes, but both of them are in elastic. 見唔見到 ？Another case, let's say another case would be、uh, here. One point eight, one point three. You see, in this case, still larger than them, but both are elastic. 兩個都 elastic 啊。Or another case, let's say this is one point eight, zero point three. Then you see. 嗱，你見唔見到阿 Sir 想講咩 ？In fact, this is a very misleading question. 原來重點唔係佢 elastic 定 inelastic. The important point is whether 
uh, whether one is more elastic. No matter elastic or inelastic, it is a comparison of bigger than one and smaller than one. Okay, but the main point is not bigger than one or smaller than one, but only whether ES and ED which one is more elastic. Now, of course, we have an answer. 我哋啦知道啦 demand and su- demand must be less elastic than supply. In this case, definitely. C is the answer. C 一定係答案嚟噶，但係重點，好多人就係揸住呢條教錯啊！你補習嗰啲啊，係嘛 ？Your tutorial teacher most likely using this question, they will teach something wrong. Okay? The main point is not inelastic and elastic. The main point is this is smaller than one. This is bigger than one. We are sure bigger than one must be bigger than smaller than one. 係咪大過一嘅數一定係比細過一個數 elastic。So the key point is more elastic, but not elastic or inelastic. OK， 得唔得？唔該，你自己小心啲揾書。This is a very very important question. OK， so many people. Wrongly teach this topic because of this stupid question. Okay, 好唔好？再嚟啦。Now in 2000， 誒誒，今次真係二零零嘅啊，係咪 ？2002， right? Suppose the government impose a、uh, uh, unit tax. Okay, 好嘛？啊 ，rel 誒誒誒誒 ，the revenue after deduction would remain unchanged. 啊，呢條又係 extreme case 嚟㗎。Let's give it. Let's give it. Okay, 又係 extreme case。點解咁多 extreme case 嘅 ？Okay, now. Let's look at the next one. 2004. Here it says, first registration tax is imposed on car, and the tax is collected from car seller. Okay. 跟住佢話啦 Suppose total tax burden of car sellers, sellers greater than buyer. Okay, bad burden. P B greater than C B. Okay. So what is the condition? The condition. Is that the supply, 係嘛 ？Supply of car is 誒誒誒大過佢，即係 is less elastic。嗱，小心啊，係 less elastic 啊，唔係 in elastic 啊。Less less elastic than demand for car. Okay, less elastic. Okay, supply less elastic, so they bear more burden. Using a diagram, okay, 係嘛啊 illustrate with a diagram, okay, less illustrate, okay. 好啦 ，diagram, something like that. Okay, 嗱唔好夠位啊，你自己揾個位畫大啲，好唔好 ？Remember, this is not extreme case. So just draw a normal demand curve. We need supply to be less elastic, so let's draw a relatively inelastic supply, which would be something like this. Let's call this S one. Now we shift the curve, the tax, so that it goes to here, S two. Okay, S two. 好啦，我哋望望啦。Now we have P one. Okay. Then we have P two, right? And remember, 头先讲过啦 The most important is actually this one. Q two, okay? Q two. 嗱，唔该你小心啊。Q two is a direct vertical. 我呢度唔够位咋，所以画得唔系咁清楚咋。Direct vertical. It should cut S one. Okay? It should cut S one. Q two is the important one. Highlight 咗佢，话俾自己听啦。Okay? Here, drop. Now remember, increase in price. This is the part where consumer will suffer. 貴咗 consumer 咪賴嘢咯 Okay, so this green box would be consumer tax burden. 好啦，但係你見到啦 vertical distance. This is the total per unit tax. 仲有成嚿喺度啊 ，sir. This part, this whole part, 
whole red part would be the producer tax burden. Okay, think about producer tax burden. Okay, let's check the question. Okay, the question needs us to uh, have. I I check. Come on. Oh, that you not. Okay, needs us to show producer tax burden greater than consumer tax burden. We get it, right? Come on. 记住啦，唔好写错啊。The condition is the supply is less elastic. 我邊個考試表見到 inelastic 嘅？自己 drop for OK and don't say I teach you OK go to drop the subject OK 好嘛好啦誒誒 C 二啦 Using the same diagram we need to show the car sellers total sales revenue net of tax OK 嗱有少少難 show 嘅呢個 OK 嗱所以啦之後都冇乜點出呢類題目啊 Net of tax remember net of tax Here, total revenue equals to total expenditure minus the tax part. Okay, remember consumer tax burden and producer tax burden, both are the tax part. If you remember the rectangle below the tax, okay, this guy, okay, below the tax, this part would be the total revenue. Net of tax, OK， 畫大少少啊，未必睇得清楚。Something like this， <coughs> 走音添。Something like this， OK。嗱，頭先嗰幅圖啦 ，this would be P2， and this would be P1。頭先嗰幅圖啦 ，if you if you can see， right？ This。誒呢個嚟嘅，呢個 Q2， OK， this is Q2， this is zero， OK， something like this， this is the consumer tax burden， while this is the producer tax burden， OK。The one below this guy will be the total revenue after tax. Okay, 嗱幾亂噶嗱 I think you can imagine the marker not having a good time marking this question. 我諗大家都會估到 mark 呢條都唔係幾開心啊，太花啦。Okay, 等等 ，so this is how you operate tax burden. Okay. Now, now we have two more questions, and then we can move back to the extreme cases. But wait for me a little bit. All right, I'm back. On to the next page. Okay. Now, okay. Now, in 2000, 2007. Okay, question 9C. Okay, it says that good X is subjected, uh, is subject to uh per unit sales tax, right? Now here, clearly. You see, right? In、uh, in、uh, in exam in DSE, they love you to draw diagram. 點解啊？年年都畫錯，咁啊年年都叫你畫咯。咁年年繼續畫錯，咪年年繼續叫你畫咯。OK， 好嘛。Under explain under what situation, what condition, consumer total spending on on good X would、uh, would decrease as a result of the introduction of the tax. OK. Now, boys, you see, I put this question here. Just to confuse you, 唔該你睇清楚條題目，問緊你啲乜嘢啊 ？Okay, here it is asking consumers total spending. 即係咩意思啊 ？T E equals to P times Q. 等阿 Sir， 唔係呢課係啊，我特登嘅。Okay, so that you need to remind yourself. There are two things in exam you need to be careful of. First, total expenditure. Second, tax burden. 兩隻字好似樣 ，OK? So very easy to mix up. 好啦，我哋諗諗啦。We know per unit tax definitely price would increase, right? Spending decrease. 
So boys, how do you balance this equation? Okay, the only way is that when the decrease in in quantity is faster, higher percentage. Okay, and this is elastic demand. Okay, then how do we explain? Okay, C one, we explain that if the demand is elastic. 好啦，你唔好就咁写 elastic 啊，得唔得？考试又需呢样嘢啊 ，don't just write elastic， right？ Then the percentage decrease in quantity transactor would be larger than the percentage increase in price. Resulting in total revenue decreasing. 嗱，前面當然有啲嘢要寫啦，係嘛 ？You also need to explain. 我都要 skip 咗啲。Supply decreases because production costs increase due to the tax. 嗱，你自己寫啦，我唔寫啦 ，OK？ 得啦。Now diagram. Nothing special. OK? Nothing special. Diagram here. Normal demand curve. 冇玩嘢啊，普通 demand. Now we need this to be elastic. Elastic 上面定下面啊 ？Of course, we are going at the upper part, right? Now, therefore, you draw the shift, all of the shift, in the upper part. Then it will be very safe. Okay, S E. Text. Okay, this is Q one. This is Q2. Okay, this is P2, and this is P1. Am I ah? Now, remember, drop in quantity. 买少咗，即系蚀钱啦。Okay, so this part. This is decrease. Okay, while this part. 哎呀，倒转咗嚟斜添。This red part. Is increased. Now you will see in this diagram the loss is greater than the gain. 嗱，統一翻啊，我寫得唔好啊。This is loss. This is gain. Right? Loss is greater than gain. Okay. In this case, total spending would decrease. Now C two indicate the change in sellers' revenue, net of tax. Okay. 嗱，呢個係好自然嘅呢 part 又係。OK， 嗱，所以我哋畫開啲先，好唔好？嗱 ，you should indicate in the same diagram， but again， this is a very old way of a setting question。你想象你係個 marker， 你見到幅圖十幾萬個嘢，你想唔想 mark 噶？所以而家 DSE 咧好少一幅圖嘅，你咁畫噶啦。嗱 ，let me just copy this for C2。嗱，你 C2 你記住唔好啊，唔好畫多個新噶，我係 f 你方便睇嘅就喺度。This is S1. This is S2. This is the tax. You will see P2 here, P1 here, Q1, Q2. Okay. Now, let's do it. Original total sales revenue. 原先係邊個 ？Originally, P1, Q1. This is the original. What about the new? Ah, I know, right? P two, Q two, right? No, wrong. 點解啊？題目講咩啊 ？Net of tax, you need to deduct the tax. Therefore, if you remember, it is actually here. P three, Q two. Okay, from P one, Q one to P three, Q two. Indicate the change in revenue, net of tax. So the change is actually this shape. I don't, I don't know how to call this shape. English 唔好啊，唔識呢個叫咩 shape 啊。Let's call it seven shape. Okay, 唔係你嗰啲 seven 啊。Okay, okay. This is a decrease in total revenue, net of tax. 嗱，所以你你明白點解阿長話啦？呢類題目咧應該唔會再咁出噶啦。So difficult to see this and this 
in the same graph as you can imagine right 好吗 as you can imagine 好吗 okay so this is how you do this question again I put this question here deliberately this is not this topic of the topic okay I put it deliberately so that you need to be careful in your examination 唔係每次都text我中意玩嘢唔畀啊 ok 嗱, one more question and then we move on to the extreme cases and we further move on to the most difficult mutational questions ok 好嘛, 好, 2016 when you see 2016 it means trouble 2016 troublesome ok 好嘛, European Union has imposed an anti-dumping tariff ok anti-dumping tariff we will learn that later but basically dumping king silver selling something below cost ok uh, unfortunately China was well known for that ok 中國原來很多傾銷啊 they are selling at a price much lower than the cost so that their competitor cannot stay in business at all ok therefore they are imposing a tax ok now for simplicity sake ok let's imagine this is a per unit tax obviously right 是吧? under what condition would producer bear greater burden than buyer ok 那这样意思啊 PB greater than CB ok if you remember it means that ES 佢食多啲啊嘛 so less elastic than ED ok 好吗? so the condition ok the condition now ok we know that the uh, uh, demand is more elastic than supply now this is the condition 喂前面那些我不寫了是不是那些什麼 uh, supply decrease due to a tax 那些我不寫了自己寫了好嗎不用時間了 not, not the main point of this chapter ok not the main point of this chapter ok demand is more elastic than supply 不是inelastic 不是elastic啊講了很多次了 ok 等等, now let's illustrate with a supply demand diagram just practice ok if you like pause the video do it by yourself ok 應該現在都有聽書應該熟的啦 ok 記住 normal demand don't do anything funny we need demand to be more elastic than supply 很容易的嗎? let's make supply less elastic S1 then let's shift it by this much and we have S2 now this is tax ok 好吗? now let's see P1 is here P2 is here but the most important 记住啦, I mark Q2 Q2 right here ok Q1 right here now increase in price who suffer? 好了,這個都講得很醜了 This is consumer tax burden What about the rest of the tax here? Rest of the tax burden would be this part Producer tax burden Let's check Producer bear more burden than consumer Yes, exactly what we need for our answer ah, By the way, just one reminder in exam, now although now uh, when I'm teaching, I use different color. In exam, you cannot use different color. No yung scan to the hapaka. Okay? So in order to indicate, learn this trick. Use different patterns. Digo chapin, digo chapin. Or some of them. Use different pattern to fill up the area. Okay? Lan mholo it doesn't work. Okay, this is not the first time I tell you. If you still do that, okay, you are more than welcome to apply to drop economics. Okay, thumb down. So this is how we do it. Hold on. Oh yes. Now unfortunately, although we are already 35 minutes into the video, but unfortunately, we are only halfway through. Yes, 
That's why this is difficult. Now let's go back to page 24. Let's check out the most tricky part in which we need to look at the situation of four extreme cases. Okay, your say go extreme case. Ke. Okay, how Now, I used to say, now I used to say, extreme case, come here, I'm sick of soon. Then, unfortunately, DSE, recent year, they decided it's a good idea to have both MC and short questions. Yeah. Okay, so unfortunately, we need to understand the extreme cases as well. Okay, come on. First, perfectly in elastic demand, which means ED equals to zero. Okay, now by the token, whoever more elastic, it less. Well, you got demand has yun chun elastic. We can conclude that it will all be consumer tax burden. Mr. Man, you think I should both consumer tax burden? Dodgeball, right? Basically, <coughs> you throw the ball to the one who's not moving, right? So let's see how it goes. We have P, we have Q. Ah, la 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 la. Some, uh, extreme cases. So this time we do funny things with our demand curve. Perfectly inelastic demand. This would be our demand. Okay, D1. Then we have supply we have our s1 we have our s2 like a label ah up west ship this is tax then q1 and q2 are the same keep it here and p1 p2 Hold on. now you will see vertical distance this is the parity tax right and the increase in price is exactly the same as that of the increase of the uh, pioneer tax. Therefore, we can conclude that all of this would be consumer tax burden. Now, funny, funny, right? Think about it. Obviously, number one, we know CB will take it all. Producer will have no burden the whole of the burden has been shifted to consumer yun chun shift outside okay number two only more yun 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 what about total revenue after tax originally p1 q1 now is p2 q1 minus this part okay P2 minus P1 times Q1, which happens to be the same. You know, you know, high unchanged. Okay, this is the only case where total revenue after tax, uh, total revenue to the producer remains unchanged. Okay, Okay, last one. You have no way to understand. I think it's quite difficult, right? So maybe in this case, like you understand me, right? I used to say, uh, if you can avoid using graph, just don't use it. I think extreme cases are is the time, is a good time to use graphical uh, 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 deduction. How about you know, using tool is easier. Okay, now by the same token. My suggestion, pause the video, try to work out the rest of the free before you continue. Okay, now I'm assuming you have done it. So here, here I go again. Perfectly in elastic supply. Okay, now in el uh, uh, supply, right? So demand, let's not do anything funny. Perfectly in elastic supply. S1 is here. A vertical curve going upward. Does it change anything? No. Now technically, okay, if you really want the most uh, precise uh, 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 definition, but for our purpose, actually, this guy doesn't change. For our purpose, okay? Which means, 
P one doesn't change. Q one doesn't change. 阿姐，冇變到啊，唔使俾水你啊，長。Remember, tax is still here. 你冇變啫嘛，你唔使交税啊。Okay, so there is still a taxation you need to pay. 嗱，好騎呢噶呢度係 ，OK， you still have a per unit tax to pay. 哎呀，哎呀，攞第二隻色啊 ，so sorry. OK, you still have a tax to pay. OK, this part. 好啦 ，Is there any increase in price? No. Therefore, we know that C B OK equals to zero. 冇 consumer tax burden， 因為冇嘅升個價嘛。This is all producer tax burden. All producer tax burden. 蝕到入肉啊。OK, there is no change in sales, but unfortunately, they still need to pay tax. 陰公。又冇賣貴到，又冇賣多到，但係最俾税 ，OK， 好嘛 ？So you will see this time C B equals to zero， 話 P B would take it all 陰公眼食曬佢 ，OK， 好嘛 ？Now what about the case of elastic perfectly elastic？ 嗱 ，the same applies， 其實都係咁做嘅啫 ，OK， 好嘛？都係咁做嘅啫。Now here let's do it。Elastic of at demand， so here。This is our D1. Okay, then we have our S1. We have our S2. Mo mo Text, right? Now here. This will be Q1. This will be P1. Okay. Now funny enough, with this taxation, actually, quantity would drop, but price would remain unchanged. 於是啦，所有嘢都會好難畫啦。OK， 嗱 ，first of all， price remains unchanged。What does that mean？ It means that C B again would be zero， 冇貴過，佢咪冇食過任何嘢咯。P B would be off。Here， vertical distance， this is the per unit tax。At Q2 啦，唔好話錯啊 ，Q2 啊。So this guy, this red guy, would be our producer tax burden. Okay, 得唔得啊？ But funny enough, even though price doesn't change, because quantity changed, you will see that total expenditure still drop. Total revenue also drop. Ah, after tax, I mean. Okay. 好似咩都冇變，但係其實所有都變曬。OK， 得唔得 ？This is the case of perfectly elastic demand. And finally, let's try perfectly elastic supply. 好啦 ，demand normal， don't do anything funny. Here we have S1， 嗱 upward shift， right？ Therefore we have S2 here. We have taxation here. Q1, Q2. 嗱，記住啊 ，Q2 係重要嗰個 important, right? Here, P1, P2. You will see, right? The increase in price is exactly the same as the tax, which means this whole part 又係 consumer 食曬 ，they will eat it all. This will be consumer tax burden. Now the funny thing, 又係啦。嗱 ，obviously C B take it all, P B no burden, but that does not mean total expenditure and total revenue doesn't change. Okay, total expenditure obviously we don't know. P increase, Q decrease. What about total? Uh, what about total revenue? Used to be P one, Q one. Now after tax, okay, after tax. It becomes P1, Q2. Actually, total revenue still decreases. Yum gong, yau di. So you see, you, if you remember, there is a question just now, right? Hama, a question asking when would total revenue after tax remains unchanged? The answer is this one. Answer is this one. Let's go to the next page. 
2002, this question, when demand is perfectly inelastic. You know, that legal case I would in turn be in yet. Okay? Not that. So, extreme cases. Now, I think there is another extreme case in 2020 or 2021. Okay? I haven't put it into this note. Okay? You, If you're interested, you can go look up that question by yourself, right? Okay, now we are 45 minutes into the video. Okay? But I'm so sorry, boys. We are not done. Now, I know some of you have been complaining. I follow text walk. I love to draw horizontal, I love to draw vertical. Because I anticipate DSC can have one very special kind of question in which it asks you both total expenditure and tax incidents. Okay? Suppose after implementation of our wine tax, okay, for our purpose, uh, per unit tax, two things happening. Total expenditure by consumer has decreased. Mom, T E equals to P times Q. We know after tax this would increase, right? How my found that it needs to decrease. What does that mean? It means that to balance this equation, we need to have Q dropping faster than P. What does that mean? It means that number one con condition number one ED needs to be bigger than one. So in that condition, ED you die go yeah. Second, consumer bear less burden. CB smaller than PB. What does that mean? It means that ED needs to also be bigger than ES. Okay, I'm done. Now, Okay, a less burden. Yes, this means ED bigger than yes. less burden. More, yes, more elastic. Okay, now so you see, if you need to draw, if you need to draw something funny, okay, you need to draw funny slope. Very likely, you will die on one of the condition. Okay, so let's try our way of working first. Why demand when you talk about elastic and inelastic? Follow the normal one. Okay? Now here. Let's deal with the first condition. First condition, we need ED, okay? We need this ED to be bigger than 1. So, let's limit ourselves to draw everything in the upper portion, okay? Now, we need ED to be bigger than ES. Or they use ED more elastic, right? Then, let's try to draw ES uh, 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 let's try to draw supply to be less elastic. Uh, in fact, very inelastic. You see that? Or you see how about here? S1. Let's shift it up to here. S2. And this is our tax. Okay. Come on. Let's see how about P1, Q1, P2, Q2. And remind yourself, Q2 is the important one. Alright, increase in price. This is consumer tax burden. Alright, tax is very big. 
here, right? We still have a lot of text remaining. This would be our producer text burden. If you follow our actual way of drawing elasticity of demand, 其实这两个 condition 你很容易控制到的 This is by controlling upper versus lower part of the Well, this condition is by controlling the slope of supply. If you are in the past, you are good luck. You are good luck. You are good luck. You are good luck. So that's why I advise you always follow this proper way. I have never seen a low mile, but it doesn't mean it cannot be mixed together. Okay, it can be in this way. That's why you draw the proper way. Okay, now you like, I know there are people who like to slope. Yes, try it. You try to draw the demand slope. If you can draw it, good on you. If you can't, shame on you. Okay, you try to draw the demand slope. You can draw it, you can draw it. Good luck. Okay, it doesn't matter. Oh, I'm sorry. Okay, <laughs> now, there is one final mutational question. Okay, which I call essay question. Now, what does that, what, what does that mean? You know what? Instead of imposing tobacco tax, Hong Kong, right? We impose tobacco tax to discourage people from smoking, right? Now, some people suggested imposing a quota on tobacco instead. No way, Lim Just set a quota. Don't let the producer produce that much, uh, 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 that many tobacco. Now, evaluate the pros and cons. Ah, sir, textbook no one. Yeah, I know. I know you can't find the answer in textbook. That's why I put it in the notes. That's the most difficult kind of question. Now, let's do this question by starting with the mechanism. Okay, now on one hand, we know, right? No, 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 no. Okay, here on one hand, we have a quota. On another hand, we have a per unit tax. Okay, how How does it work? The mechanism quota they actually limits the quantity. 直接在quantity度打落去, while this one push up the price using law of demand to push down the QD or QT okay dam da or right and uh, or uh, just a supply decrease making sure QS also decrease now do you see the difference so immediately it actually has to do with your objective. How do you evaluate it? If the objective, let's say, if the objective is to limit, okay, or, or I should say, directly cut down on tobacco. Then you will see quota is much more direct. Unit tax Boys, do you remember? This is actually indirectly reducing the quantity only. Let's say if it is indirectly 
inelastic demand, which is very likely. In total, inelastic ah, 大佬 addition 啊嘛 Then unfortunately, the drop in Q would be very limited. 系咪啊？你加價有鬼用咩？要吸煙嘅咪照吸，係咪啊 ？So this is the bad thing about unit tax in a way that it is indirect and very reliant on elasticity of demand， 係咪啊？好 depends on。And the bad thing is we are sure tobacco very likely the at at the Elasticity will be very low because of addiction. 咁咪做唔到呢個 objective 咯，係嘛 ？But if the objective is earning money for the government, then most likely unit tax, the earning will be much higher than the quota if there is any earning in quota at all. Okay, most likely. Okay, well, this one the earning is much lower. So at the end of the day, it really depends on what is the objective of the policy. If the objective is for public health, you want to get rid of tobacco, then use quota. Use quota. Quota. 話知你嚴唔嚴格？我話得五誒得五支就五支。Okay. Totally independent of elasticity, very direct, very forceful. 冇得吸就冇得吸。While on another hand, if government revenue is a very big concern, then use taxation. Most likely, you get a lot of tax. In fact, in Hong Kong, I think tobacco tax is a very big income. 係咪？都收幾多煙草税嘅 ？OK， 香港都收到幾多煙草税嘅？ Okay, done that. So, boys, this is but one example of mutational question on this topic. Okay, and another example, obviously, we talk about why you should draw it in a proper way. Okay, now we are almost one hour long for this video. Okay, now I understand this is a very difficult and very long, very boring video. But please, boys, this is the most difficult part in DSC. Take your time. To revise this topic for the next few videos, we are moving on to something even more difficult. I'm so sorry. 係咪你覺得 tax 好難？對唔住 ，subsidy 仲難。OK, next few videos, let's go to the most most difficult part. OK, see you in the next video at Oil. See you soon.